off so morning time this is my wash and go um i'm not sure if the wash and go video will be up before or after this but um this wash and go was achieved with urban hydration um i don't think they're really a big company so just stay tuned for the wash and go video if it isn't up by the time i post this so today which is really weird because yesterday i didn't like the wash and go but today i'm kind of feeling it um even though it's kind of frizzy um because it's mad humid in um memphis <coughs> we're still gonna work with it so i don't know what i really want to do with it so i'm gonna fluff it first make it a little bigger than what it already is let's see what side does my Ooh, i like the way it falls on this side though so I think I just want to kind of pull this back right here. So let me grab some bobby pins. And I'm kind of just winging it right now because I didn't really plan on what I wanted to do with my hair. What side? I like the way the curls look on this side better. Like flip this way. So, I'm going to, I'm going to twist it and pull it all the way up there. You know I got to do my crisscross bobby pins because my hair likes to stay yeet and fall down. Okay, so there's that. And then... y'all think you flip it some more over here maybe I should pull some more back don't want to do the side joint today like which I think Leave this down. And let it roam free. That's kind of lit. That's pretty simple, but pretty lit. Let me do my edges and that'll tell me for real what's really good. You already know. Style Factor Edge Booster. The one, my favorite one right now is the strawberry. I love the way it smells. Honestly, truly. The grape one is really good too. Okay, do we want to be extra on the edges today or what? Um, the reason why I don't really show me doing my edges in my videos, why I haven't been lately, is because um, I have some new Style Factor Edge Boosters coming. Like, they're, they're newer ones. And I'm going to try them out on camera for you guys. And we're going to learn how to flick our edges together. So in case you guys were wondering why i haven't been really i mean i've been showing it but it's kind of been like a quick run through and i might just do like a different type of edges tutorial like different kinds like for the days i want to be subtle and then the days that i want to be extra because i have those days all right y'all so i'm back with the edges and i think i'm feeling it okay I know these hair tutorials lately have been really simple, but these are the honest to God ways that, ooh, these are the ways that I've been wearing my real hair between classes and homework and stuff like that. I really don't be having time. So like these hair tutorials that I be putting up, literally I just turn on the camera before I leave for class and record it real quick and in between classes. I upload them um but like yeah that's the only way i can kind of get all my tutorials in where they fit in um because between the wigs and then my real hair i'll be fed up between the both of them so i just be switching back and forth so when i decide to put on a wig or decide oh i want to style a wig and i don't have no homework then that's when i record those videos and then so on so 
yeah but if you like these comment below let me know these are like so much more realistic than actually sitting down and just recording a tutorial because I know you guys want one. Like this is literally the real thing. I'm finna go to class to have a test today in history. Pray for me. Um, so yeah, sometimes they're really simple, but it's really what I do from day to day. So um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Um, don't know if I'll have the wash and go video before this because that's kind of longer. So it'll take longer to edit and I could probably get this video up before class. So <clears throat> Thanks for watching, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye. Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hello, hello. Yeah. 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 Yeah.